hello. We're just gonna pop right in to art today. Oh, I'm not even sharing my screen. It's been a day. <laughs> we'll go to the screen while I get the reflector up. Hello, Avery, Elvarsi, hello, Ali, maybe Ali, hello, Patty, hello, Patty. How are you guys doing today? Welcome in. My dumb butt didn't even stream my <laughs> screen yet. What a day. What a time to be alive. Um, I hope everybody's doing well and taking care of themselves. It is Thursday today. 9196. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, that's uh, artwork from a wallpaper website. My friend sent it to me, so I'm not sure who the artist is. So I'll have to find that out. Just moving my screen on over here. It should be good to go. Move that there. We'll move. Also, yeah, I guess, Patty, you haven't seen the update yet. This is the change. This is how we look in. We've got a few updates uh, in general on this stream, but uh, the biggest one is changing it more to a Hey Liz theme mixed with Baxter instead of just an all Baxter theme, which I definitely like a lot better. It is a lot more, a lot more me, which is nice. And this is what we're working on today. You know, okay, so the more that I thought about it, the more I think the tulips would actually be better if they were like white. Um, so I'm going to try that out first today, just because the colors, like it's a lot of colors going on. I just have to clean my glasses. But yeah, there's so much pink and red mixed with the blue, um, which is making the blue look a little purple, which is totally fine. Um, but it's just about trying to find that color balance and make sure that it looks how it should look. I don't have my glasses on. I can see you sent a message. Give me one second. I'm just cleaning them. I cannot see. All right, yay for Halos plus Baxter, yeah! I became quite meh by the end of the day, so I'm gonna just be here for the good vibes. I'm sorry to hear that you've been meh. Um, did you eat a good meal? Is there anything I can do? We'll keep the good, <laughs> what is that from? Let's keep the good vibes going. I don't like how the top of the screen is just a little bit cut off. There you go. Okay. Yes, that looks good. Oh, Avery, did you not have a good day either? Just one of those days. Well, I'm sending all of my love. Hopefully we can just have a good time. A good, a good old vibe in time. We're going to try to make these white. Maybe like subtly pink, but otherwise white which i think will be really cool especially in contrast with the pants you know all right so we're just gonna lower the saturation i definitely think that helps kind of bring it bring it together a bit better your head is hurting. I'm sorry. Are you going to take some some medication? Yeah, right? I agree, Avery. I agree. Um, so I believe we are at a point where... Do I want to keep this red or do I want it to be more purple like that? I think I kind of like the contrast of the red, but we'll keep them separate just in case. Let's start merging things. <laughs> Baxter stole my necklace? Yeah, it looks like she took your moon necklace. She just, she just took it. All hers now. Baxter does love you. This is factual, Alvarsi. <laughs> Felt faint after the tattoo? Did you get a new tattoo? Is this is this you trying to tell me you got a new tattoo and I didn't know? <gasps> Welcome in, Justin. How are you doing? I did just see your message. Are you sure? Is it for an NPC? Is it for a PC? What you thinking? Oh, you did the tattoo. Oh, did you drink enough water during the day? White would look nice with a nice contrast or could go multicolor gold and white. The problem is, is that so with the red and the blue, it's already such a dark piece. So I'm thinking if I put that white in, especially because her pants are more of a white color, I think it'll help. 
<laughs> Don't hide. It's all right. I'm a player. I'm a player. I'm a... Oh, actually, we need to take a moment. Um, let me explain myself. There's a new song coming out today that I've been incredibly excited for because it reminds me of Laverin, um, a.k.a. Amarin and Lavender. Uh, and it came out at five. So I'm going to play that real quick, and then we'll go back to this playlist. Um, it's called Beautiful Things by Benson Boone. Be sure to go give him some love if you're into this song. Uh, I have no idea who he is. This is not an ad. I just literally have been obsessed with this song. So I will not be talking while I listen to this song. You can enjoy it with me. Oh, so good. It's slower than I thought it would be. It's called Beautiful Things. It was released 14 minutes ago, Justin. I've been waiting for it forever. Not forever. It feels like forever. Um, but the chorus literally makes me want to start bawling. Like, it's just, oh, it's so good. Oh, good. Definitely go show him some love. I've been listening to this course on repeat. So, okay, so I'll go back to the playlist now. So basically, I heard this song and I cannot get over how much it reminds me of Lavender and Amrin because Amrin recently said I love you to um hold on I'm gonna restart this playlist from scratch um Amrin recently said I love you for the first time in her entire life um she's never said it to anybody before other than platonically to her best friend Ren uh and she instantly regretted well she didn't regret it she just thought that Lavender was gonna leave her for it because it was pretty quick um and so the lyrics are Oh, God, I don't have the lyrics in front of me right now, but it's so good. It's literally just, ugh, it's, ugh, it's so, ugh, it's so good. I love it so much. Wasn't it? Definitely go show some love. Again, that's Benson Boone, B-O-O-N-E, on Spotify. The song was literally just released. He has no idea who I am. I've just been obsessed with the song, so he's on TikTok. That's where I found it. Speaking of music, one of me and Ellie's favorite, I heard, they just announced our new tour. Yes, see, I've heard that you've already purchased tickets without asking anyone to go with you. You just you just bought the tickets, and I love that for you. I love how you're just, like, fully ready to go. Yes, sleep token. This is your friendly reminder to hydrate. Oh, baby Baxter. All right. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> okay, again, this is not how it's actually going to look. They're just they're just there. So I ignore that. Now, I want to use these colors throughout the piece to try and make it make more sense. So I'm going to like do some soft pink on the inside of this red, for example. And we will go from there. Can you help me navigate? They were expensive, but they just revealed a bunch more tour dates. Of course, no Canada. Avery, go travel to where Justin is and make him take you. <laughs> All right. So I definitely want to do her face first because it's really bothering me if I'm being honest. So we're going to do her eyes and then her face. So I have to end stream on time today because I have a little date planned with my friend. And then after that, I am watching Critical Role with some other friends, including that friend. So I have to make sure <laughs> that I, I get off stream when we're done at eight. Oh, they play in Montreal and Toronto? See, that's Canada. Avery, that's Canada. <laughs> oh, hi, Nat. I'm doing well. I'm so sorry I missed your first message. How have you How have you been? It's nice to see you. That's so sweet. Did I, uh, I feel like I missed messages. Yes, okay, I think I'm good. Always expensive, yes. Everything is so expensive these days. On that note, do you know what's not expensive? My emergency commissions. If you're interested. <laughs> oh, well, I hope that the stream can cheer you up or at least put you in a good mood while, mood while whilst you're here. You can have a good time. We're working on a piece for Valentine's Day. I'm trying to be ahead of the game this time with uh, holidays and stuff. Shameless plug, I love you. I'm doing my best. I keep watching this streamer. His name's... Uh, big puffer tv and he like super shamelessly plugs his shit all the time but like really i don't know really aggressively but casually and i really enjoy it so i'm trying to remember that it is a job i should be doing it <laughs> oh well happy early birthday i hope you have a good time you got anything fun planned Baxter is baby. Thank you. She's baby, but she's not infant. We were talking about how it's so funny because, like, the term calling calling somebody baby is so cute, but calling them infant is freaking weird. It's so funny. Words are weird. Let me go. I feel like this is too saturated. Yeah, okay. Well, that sounds nice. I hope we have a lot of fun. Oh, that's awesome. What kind of appetizers would they be then? Any particular favorites that you'd recommend? Also, bowling sounds so fun. I, because <laughs> my hands, I have a really hard time when we go bowling. I um, can't always take part, um, especially, well, if it's the five pin, like the smaller one, I usually can. But um, my friends forgot that once and booked a 10 pin and I can't do it because um, my fingers. So <laughs> I hope that you have fun. <laughs> not infant yes because that's weird <laughs> Bees and running women. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Yeah. ricky you should blame ellie for not having <laughs> For it, pick the character I'm going to play because I can't make a decision for myself. I'm kidding, kinda. Are you talking? Wait, are you talking about for pirates? Oh, it's a ways away, my guy. You could think of a character right now, and then like a who knows, maybe a year from now, you'd be like, but this character. I always wait until we're like, okay, like I get like really into my character in that moment, so I always wait until we have like 
the announcement because then I go hard. That's true. If you do pick them ahead of time, you could get them commished. This is accurate information. Once again, everybody, <clears throat> emergency commissions are open. I really need to pay my bills. <laughs> if you're into that sort of thing, um, a portrait is only 175 US dollars with a Patreon membership, which is actually very cheap because they used to be like, I think, 275 So if you're into that sort of thing, saving like 100 buckaroos. Actually, you're saving even more because the prices went down this year. The only difference is I no longer, I do not do, um, what's the word? Complicated backgrounds on commissions anymore. I want to save that for illustration work that I would like to do or commercial work. Commished. I really enjoy that word. Commished. I, in fact, will not accept commissions anymore unless it's called a commish. I've decided that's the best the best option. <laughs> I still need to figure out who to get you to draw. Like I said, I'm uh, I'm partial to Knox, but also it's becoming also partial to Lorian. So it's becoming a problem. You'll have to decide. I will say I do enjoy, enjoy drawing the ladies a lot more than dudes. But if uh, you're like, hey, best friend, uh, learn how to draw men better and tell me to draw Lorian, I will. So you, you, I'll let that, you decide that. <laughs> and add layer. Did someone say something about grandpa? Grandfather? Yes, old man Lorian. <laughs> what if he's actually like secretly like super, super old in a young person's body? Um, and Bryn knows that. <laughs> Does he have any stubble or facial hair? Because I really prefer to draw dudes that do. I'm not going to lie. Otherwise, I have such a hard time. He owns his body. Hell yeah. <laughs> Lauren is secretly a 5,000 year ancient dragon cats out of the bag can you imagine if you were telling the truth but you like totally knew we'd never fall for it like you just dropping truths like that midstream <laughs> I did look at your picture I'm just forgetful in my head I'm picturing orange man with lower extremities I <laughs> the face is not memorized you know what i mean he had a zombie hand wait what 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 i don't know what you're talking about no i'm not rude no i'm just i just my brain has such limited space you know and i gotta prioritize what gets put in there you have to understand <laughs> he is more than a piece of meat but right now well, Emily, right now Emily is like, "Oh, this guy, this guy's a this guy likes to oh, boobs on my head. This guy likes to do things, you know? Um, with lots of ladies. That's what Emily knows." Look at Baxter. Hello, Ice does things. How are you doing today? Welcome in. Welcome to 2024 streams. The entire vibe is different and the PNG tuber doesn't look like she's staring into your soul and might eat it. <laughs> I hope you're doing well. I hope 2024 has treated you nicely thus far. We are working on a Valentine's Day Baxter piece for the Patreon. <laughs> likes guys. Wait, this guy likes to do things. You know what I mean. You're picking up what I'm putting down. He has like a smaller eyebrows beard. Okay, okay, okay. And because we're on the road, that means that his shaved areas would also probably have a bit of stubble on them. Or does he bring a razor around with him? He probably does. He's a bard, so he travels, I would assume. Promise I ain't going nowhere. Oh. He manscapes. I love that for him. Ah! 
Yeah, like dress up like Faye. I mean, who would ever do that? Wait, 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 wait. Dress up like a Faye. Wait, what did I miss? What are we talking about? It's so scary when I just do the eyes because then they're like super realistic. They're not realistic, but they still look a lot more alive than the rest of the piece. And it's kind of spooky. <laughs> I thought we were still referring to me. Wait. Oh my gosh, now my brain is confused. Sorry, we were talking about, okay. You're, so I have a new campaign, Ayas. So um, I'm in a campaign on Fridays called War of uh, Valaria, and I have a character named Emily. And Elvarsi has a character named Lorian, um, who's a very attractive, uh, tall uh, sun elf, I believe. And that's that's who we're talking about. He He likes to get around, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm just going to throw some shadows here. Classic bard. Yes. <laughs> it explains the confusion. Just a good old bard. Nothing else at all going on there. Something suspicious. Um, also, I asked, the Moist Prophet is the DM for our new campaign. He has a completely homebrew world. It's incredible. You should see my notes one day. I'd love to show them off. They're so cool. They're so deep. But I also don't want to give any any spoilers on Justin's world because it is his. But I am keeping a calendar. I have become the, the lore keeper because <laughs> I'm crazy. Yeah, not at all. <laughs> who the party would most likely be the Among Us imposter? That's the real question. I think it would be as Mira. I do. I really do. I really want to trust her, but oh, man, her and her staff. Suspicious. <laughs> yeah, we don't need to worry about that war. Pfft. We got enough to worry about with our weird party. A weird, amazing party. Tic-tac-toe. Plot twist. It's Ronin. Honestly, also wouldn't be surprised. Thank you. I, so I originally was planning for her to have like more tiefling like eyes, but I didn't want it to be a spoiler right away that she was a tiefling. So that's why she is not uh, as tiefling in the eyes as I wanted her to be. Lucas, you're awake. Oh, my God. Welcome in. Fallen morning. Um, how are you awake right now? <laughs> are you good? <laughs> oh, wait, no. I guess it's like a normal time now for you. Thank you. I always do it the same way. I'm pretty sure I, my, uh, my eye tutorial is still actually up to date. Um, but I use a details brush from Hey Mary Jean to help. That way I don't have to draw the little details. But I could... But I do like the way the Hey Me Your Jean ones look. Hey Mary Jean. Oh my god. Totally fumbled that. 
I just know I'm going to be listening to that song over and over. Like, I already want to listen to it again, but I don't need to irritate y'all <laughs> on my second day of stream in 2024. I know you changed this new up a bit. Is the Baxter Tarot card still live? Yes, you can absolutely do the poll. They are very much still a thing. You can still ask Baxter things. Absolutely. If you want to make the PNG tuber actually super <laughs> um, ready for that as well, there is an option in your channel points. I should really be asleep still because I did not get to sleep until the early morning, but Shiba is being a menace and mom is yelling. So, oh no, Shiba, how dare. You could just not sleep. Um, and then you'll have an extra good sleep the following night. Ha ha. Just kidding. Don't do that. Don't listen to me. My advice is absolutely bad. I need to do my ritual Baxter question, which always happens to be incredibly accurate. They are new. There's a lot of new channel point options, everybody. If you'd like to change the way Baxter looks, just keep in mind that they do overtake the current Baxter and they only last for a, I think, five minutes and some of the bigger ones last for 10. Um, it's kind of like a battle of the fittest because um, the app that I use doesn't allow me to queue them up. <laughs> Because, like, I could add a cooldown to one of them, but then it won't affect the other one. So I have to wait for that one. <gasps> I am a goose now. <sighs> Who needs Baxter? <laughs> I like how I'm like, oh, you could totally get the tarot card Baxter up, get her t fully prepared. But you're like, do you know what? I want the goose to tell me my future. <laughs> I thought I would have a good sleep. Whoop last night because I was sleepy at a normal time. But as soon as I was in my bed, my body was suddenly very awake. I recall, I saw you were in a call. You stayed awake. <laughs> Goose. Goose. Yes. On that note, friendly reminder, everybody, that uh, if you do sub once per month um, per person, you can request a goose. And then not this Friday, but next Friday, we are going to do doodle goose and just, just draw a bunch of gooses. <laughs> Honk. Oh, also, little side note, if anybody is interested in donating bits, I do have some new sounds available, including some Astarian ones. You can check those out on my info page or about page. I think it's info. It might be about um, on my <laughs> on my thingy. On my Twitch channel. All right, let's get Baxter's face Baxtering, shall we? Baxter, what awaits the party after delivering the message to Goldthorn? Anyone for whom money is important, those who believe money is the key to their success. Interesting. Interesting. Le honk, omelette de fromage. Honk. Mm hmm. fat paycheck time i hope so we were only i think promised 200 gold and i don't think that's per person so i don't think it would be that <laughs> honk <laughs> I love how it includes his laugh. It's so cute. Thank you for the 500 bits. I could listen to that on repeat. It's so good. Oh, man. Literally so good. I can't remember what the other one is. I think there's Gustarian. Like the that, uh, that little song he did. <laughs> 
It's so cute. I love his laugh. I left for like seven minutes and y'all lost it. What do you mean? Lost it? You're crazy. We're so, so sane. So sane. I was not oogling nothing. I just, you know, the anatomy was good. It was good anatomy. Didn't remember what his face was. How do you foresee Baxter? Betrayers Rise Part 2, Electric Boogaloo. What is that? Oh my god. Lorian is hot. This is fact. Rip egg. What egg? Whose egg? Better Amelie in check? Wait, what? What do you mean better Amelie in check? I play a shifter. Concern. Oh no. Man, her face claim is so difficult. I hope I can pull this off. She has the roundest cheeks. Bryn is very pleased with Lauren's, you know, <laughs> face. Oh my God, my goose like shut its eyes at the same time. So it looked like it was winking. What idea? Oh, better keep Emily in check. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Where, if he meets Emily's fiance, he's going to be like, look at this song I wrote. Cause your boyfriend's a bitch. He ain't shit. He can suck on my appendage. <laughs> so good what a perfect song i just love to imagine that like like we go we we meet amelie's fiance and lorian's like oh let me play a song of my people just casually <laughs> and then it's that song stares at him the entire time <laughs> i'm just picturing Brit and lorian but like cue that still from rotel dorado <laughs> yes the song of my people Cause your boyfriend's a bitch, he ain't shit, he can suck on my dick. <laughs> I really want a meme now of, of drawn of Lorian and Bryn in that still. Julio and Miguel, yes, factual. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay, Houston, we have a problem. All right, so we have a couple things I want to attempt to fix. One, nose is too long. Two, I'm going to now redo the liquify so that way I don't accidentally undo what I did. This needs to... Her chin is smaller. I think that's better. <laughs> Mighty and powerful gods. Exactly. <laughs> Who cares about work? You need to draw Bryn and Lorian as them. It needs to happen. Ugh. Just readjusting my chair. Mm -hmm. 
Another thing is that her eyes are too big, but we'll see if I change it. Because it's also a style option, but we'll see. Yeah, it's good for your creative brain. Patty's totally right. <laughs> is anybody watching the critical role thing tonight they are on a sick break so uh i can't remember which ones but some of them are making their characters in Baldur's gate 3 and i'm so excited i'm so excited <laughs> Look at her, she's so cute. Okay, this definitely looks better. I was getting nervous there. Her nose was a million miles too long. <laughs> Okay, if I suddenly disappear, Toby has used his magical, powerful magics and has knocked me the fuck out. If you need to sleep, Lucas, you also need to try to sleep. Go get Toby and put him on your head. <laughs> Make the decision for Toby. Good. I like to hear that. So should we listen to Beautiful Things again or should we be responsible? Who is Julio and who is Miguel? Well, you're the one playing the lute. So do the do the one who's playing the ukulele or whatever as Lorian. That's my vote. <laughs> can I can I do both, Patty? I'm not sure. Yes. No, no, no. I know that it's sorry, did I say lute? I meant Lear. But still, I feel like it makes sense to do uh, Lorian as the one holding the string instrument. Okay, wait, can someone remind me, uh, blonde or brunette, who is who? Julio or Miguel? Tulio. Tulio, not Julio. Ahaha. You guys are coming with me. Both is good. No, I shouldn't do it. Then I'll get lost in this playlist and you guys will hear it go over and over again. You'll hate me forever. I will I will keep my cool. Miguel is the blonde. Okay. I love how <laughs> I love how a Avery said Tulio is brunette and Ellie said Mc Miguel is the blonde, but like simultaneously. Like it was pre-planned. I love that for you guys. Yes, but it's not about their technical vibes. It's just about the pose, I think. It's just about the meme. So that's okay. These need to be moved up. She looks angry. Mm-hmm. 
Because Prin does not give Miguel vibes. We all know she's chill. <laughs> Hydrate, everybody. I feel like I could have so much water right now. I'm so excited for D&D &D tomorrow. <laughs> Why is it so far away? Yeah, how dare. Tomorrow I will be working until stream. Um, stream is at three. And then at six, I'm going over to my sister's and she's cooking me dinner because we have HelloFreshes and cooking stresses me out. Um, so we're going to use the HelloFreshes, but she's going to cook it. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to come home in time for D&D &D after doing her dishes that she made. Um... <laughs> All right, session right now. Right now. Do you know what I'm thinking? I've been thinking that Emily needs to do something about her hair. I feel like she doesn't want it down. I feel like she's deciding on this trip that she wants it up. And so I've been kind of deciding on how she wants to do it. I'm thinking like a bubble braid or something like that. But I feel like being her, it makes sense that she wouldn't be as comfortable like having it all down and in the way all the time. Yeah, I might have her braid it. I might have, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll draw it out before we do it in game so I know what it is intended to look like or something. But I do think her hair down would be driving her crazy with all this travel. Picking up from last session, our group of adventurers continued on their... Oh, wait. <clears throat> I, I, I did something special, you guys, and I haven't gotten to show you. So let's use it right now. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Ahem. Picking up from last session, our group of adventurers continued on their journey to the city of Goldthorn, taking to the road once more on their trusty wooden wagon in cloud and mist-filled days. Along the journey, the party came across what seemed like an abandoned assortment of tents. Hello! I have this thing that I've been wanting to show you guys, um, but uh, I haven't had a reason to, so I, I utilized this moment this exact moment. I hope you enjoy. Um, I decided to make this screen for uh, any sort of fun little announcement thingies or <laughs> if we have like the writing challenge and if I'm reading aloud and stuff like that. So I, I made a little stage. Isn't it so cute? It was so fun. Hi, kitchen. Welcome in. Hello. <clears throat> we should get back to the art, but I... Uh, I wanted to use this excuse. <laughs> so I hope you you enjoyed it. <laughs> All right. Back to Baxter. The stage reveal. I literally like was to Ellie today. I was like, how can I make the stage reveal happen today? Thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed. I always wanted to do like reading streams, but you have to like in like I don't like doing that unless I have the rights to the book. Um so, alas, we haven't done it. Every lore secret here. That's how we're going to drop all the lore. Let's just get Baxter ready to go. Tell me when you're gone. Mm -hmm. 
could I write my own book? Oh, I wish. I would love to like read character backstories on here and stuff. That'd be so fun. What is this zombie hand thing that you've mentioned? What does this mean? What are you talking about? What? What are you guys talking about? Oh, hey, I'm Eepy now. <laughs> Is that because you are sleepy fallen? Me and Baxter can match. <sighs> it's Eepy time. I know Lorian's secret. Hi, Brooke. Welcome in. <laughs> Baxter is getting her much needed rest. A tummy. Have fun, Patty. Thank you so much for stopping in. What do we got here? I'm being bullied. He had a zombie hand. What does that mean? That would be a fun stream thing. Which part? Which part? The reading character backstories? That would be fun. I'd love to do that. But alas, I don't really know how I would do that. I do have YouTube videos, though. Annalise Backstory is coming out in public on the 26th. If anybody's interested, other than the party members, you're not allowed to watch. Strictly prohibited. <laughs> watch what? Watch what? Don't you dare. Do not betray me. It is a secret. Although I will say, I will say, this character is more likely to tell her secrets sooner rather than later. So wait, wait. <laughs> you, we'll, we'll talk later, Ellie. <laughs> Justin, you're the DM, you don't count. Sooner like tomorrow, there's a possibility. There was a reason Emily wanted to talk to Esmira. Although now she's not so sure. <gasps> Eblos. R.I.P. Maybe. Mm -hmm. I love him so much. Ebros needs to come back. Ooh, uh, that'd be cool. It was one night Emily still asked Mira's favorite. Well, I don't know if she's not feeling that way because she listened to your entire conversation. But it's okay. It's all right. She's still, she's, she's not a, she's, this is my one character I've written that is not someone who prefers to keep secrets. So don't stress. To prove conversation is you listening to prove conversation to private conversation is on her friend is on her friend. Wait, what do you mean? I'm confusion. I'm confusion. <laughs> it's on Emily. Oh, I mean, true. It's true. But she was right there and she wasn't sleeping anyways. It was not a pre-planned listen, to be fair. To be fair, she did not go, hey, I'm going to stay up to listen to this conversation. It was, I know these, I know these people are not watching our camp right now, so I'm going to stay awake. But if she got up, then you would know she's awake. And then she would feel bad <laughs> by insulting you. So alas. Then they left and she didn't follow. See, I think that says a lot right there. Her goal was not to listen in. It just, she happened to. <laughs> As Mira and Lorraine had an intense hand-holding competition. Oh, boy. 
Did they go kiss in the woods? Maybe. You'll never know. You're next, Emily. Oh, God. Okay, listen. Bryn and Lorian didn't sneak. No, they just went for privacy. I wouldn't call it sneaking. By the way, they walked back. They were hiding nothing. Let's be real. We all know about Bryn and Lorian. Me looking at prices of the commissions, thinking hard on it. They're really, really cheap now. And I have emergency comms open, so they're extra cheap. Dun, 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 dun. I got it. I can't wait to tell you more about Amelie Kitchen. She's my newest character. I don't know if we've talked about her yet. I'll leave it up to you. You let me know. You message me. I'm still behind on commissions, but... This, this is just queuing up for 2024. You've seen her. That's true. I do have her backstory. It'll be released on not this Friday, but next. Wanna be? That's warm up. Or not warm up, but... <laughs> thank you yes if anybody's interested once again we've got emergency weave weave is me and baxter i guess <laughs> got emergency commissions open um they're 20 10 percent off for regular commissioners and 30 percent off for um patreon members which makes a portrait uh, 175 us dollars instead of 250 um and then they're also uh, $100 cheaper this year than they were last. Also, Baxter is dead. <laughs> Rip. She's so cute. I love her. She needs some color. Some blush. Wait, what did I miss? I read that as dad. Call me father. <laughs> She's a dilf. Dead I'd like to fuck. <laughs> ah, I'm on a date now. Oh, oh my gosh. The battle begins. <laughs> Flowers is kind of like a date. I was like debating on giving her cherry blossoms, but it just didn't fit the vibe. Date didn't end well. I mean, that's twoo. I mean, actually, okay, so Baxter had a great time on the date, and that's the funny thing is Ebros felt so guilty, and Baxter's like, that was amazing. We kicked their asses. That was great. So, you know, <laughs> things are in the, the eye of the beholder, or the grass is greener. I don't know. <laughs> One of those sayings. He's like, oh, my God, I killed her. And she's like, yeah, that was amazing. Yeah, that sounds accurate. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and she's like, oh my god, I'm alive because of him. So isn't that just interesting? It's like that little kid in The Incredibles. Yes, exactly. Da, da, yeah, hurting. 
Okay, let's just doodle out the teeth here. So this is the middle. And then one, two, and three. And then one, two, one, two, three, four. Okay, so I have to fix that. And then we'll lower the opacity of this because we're just using that as a guideline. this and then more shadows specifically back here. Hi, I recently heard a song that reminded me of your new blonde girl elf, Emily, I believe. Tastes like sympathy. I'm, okay, excuse me. One moment, please. Let me do a quick search here. Tastes like sympathy by, are the lyrics appropriate? Am I gonna get banned? Oh. <gasps> What's a short song? What's a short long song? Lilith, what the fuck? This is so close. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Let me just add this to her playlist one moment, please. Where is it? Add to playlist. Emily. Wow. Also, welcome in, Lilith. Wow, what an entrance. Pat on the back. Wow. I'm just, like, looking at the lyrics, and it's actually scary. Like, I think it definitely has a darker feel to it than what Emily is, but definitely similar in, in mood and a lot of the words in themselves. I've been trying to catch your stream to share, but it's nighttime for, oh no. I hope you're getting a good rest. It's probably, is it nighttime for you now? Hello, feisty. We're just gonna finish the song. Then I'm gonna play the song I'm obsessed with again. And then we'll go back to my playlist. It's definitely darker than what Emily's story is. I'm really excited for you to to hear her story. It comes out on the 26th, but like it still fits in a way. You'll have to hear her backstory to to hear. Um, and remember, once you guys hear the backstory, you can't give any spoilers out um, during stream because a lot of my the players that are in the game with me are in chat. Although a lot of her secrets will probably be revealed decently soon. Yes, I'm excited to share. I would love to share her whole backstory with you guys right now, but I don't want to send my friends away. <laughs> but I have a stage set up 
for when we can share things. <laughs> oh, my thumb hurts so much all of a sudden. I have decided yes. What have you, uh, yes for what? I have decided yes. Oh my God, I'm so excited to share it with you guys. Literally, if I could right now, I would read out the entire backstory to you. Like right now. I am streaming till eight o'clock my time. Um, let me just play this song again. And then, here we go. Ah, there we go. Play. Yeah. Do it, I dare you. I mean, I'd have to send you guys away. And that makes me feel bad. Oh my God, my thumb has such pain. What do you mean? But I'll try to be back. Sounds good. <laughs> this is the song i've been obsessed with lately everyone go show some love to benson boone just wait till you hear the chorus if you haven't heard the song yet you're just gonna melt the benson boone song yep this is it Beautiful things. <laughs> yep. Such a labyrinth song. You Are you guys fucking ready? Prepare yourselves. Turn it up. Turn it up right now. Oh, it's so good. Oh, my God. Oh. You've probably heard it on TikTok. It's been going viral. Just the chorus. It was released uh, an hour and 10 minutes ago. Bye, Kit. I'll miss you. Sorry, I turned up the music really loud. Oh, the chorus. Literally, I want to die. Like, it makes my entire body just so happy. It was released at 5. Literally, it was released at the beginning of my stream. I've been waiting and waiting. <laughs> Tiny Bax, thank you. I'm glad you think she's so cute. I love her so much. I'm just going to play the Amarin playlist for a bit. It's so good. Um, also, did I add that song on yet? I did not. Let me go back there. Amran, very good. All right, let me know if the music is too loud. I kind, of, I kind of fucked with the sound there. All right, what did I miss? I'm sorry, I'm so into that song, you guys. I think Justin had to go. You're staying? You're staying! Okay, kitchen left, though. Bye, Kit. I think I said bye already. Thank you for the lurk. Yeah, it was released just over an hour ago. Literally amazing. Also, Ricky, I love the new stream setup. Thank you! 
Tiny Vax is so cute. Thank you. I love her so... Oh, there's so much backs on the screen right now. Holy moly. Um, I love this PNG tour so much. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Also, if you're interested in dressing her up, I have a lot of channel point options. So I clicked away from the stream a moment. An ad started playing, and I got really confused about if Baxter was trying to sell me on filing taxes. Are you joking? That is exactly her goal in life, is to make sure everybody files their taxes on time. <laughs> And she's very stinky. <laughs> That's so funny. Stinky Baxter. Baxter always has lavender soap on her because she's worried she smells because she cannot smell. So she does not know. Oh, you're done your doodle. Are you sharing it in the Discord? Long enough to be a man. Lower in your expectations. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. <gasps> Let me just open this up. Cause your boyfriend's a bitch. He ain't shit. He can suck on my dick. For those of you who don't know, this is a little joke that they're talking about doing for um, during our Friday campaign because, um, well, Emily has a fiance that's been revealed in game, so I can tell you that. And uh, this is what they said they're going to do if they ever meet him. <laughs> they're going to they're going to play a song in celebration and happiness, just casual. And then they're going to play this. This doodle is done by El Varsi, who is in the chat. This is Lorian and this is Bryn. Bryn belongs to maybe Ellie and Lorian belongs to El Varsi. <laughs> so good. Thank you so much for that doodle. Absolute perfection. So fucking good. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Also, quick shout out, everybody. Feisty Guava is an amazing artist, and they recently shared uh, her D&D games, like, like formal outfits. It's so good. It's so pretty. Um, please check out Feisty Guava on Twitter um, and Instagram, although I don't think you use Instagram very often, if that's correct. Correct me if I'm wrong. It's so good, right? Well, suck it up. You're getting a shout out. <laughs> Well deserved. What? All right, all right. Whew. We've got a cute little nose. These beautiful things that I've got. Okay, okay, okay. I use IG sometimes. I'm trying to do better at it. I just try and post, like, simultaneously. I don't always, though. I definitely post more on Twitter, but that's because I can, like, I feel like I can shit post on Twitter as well, whereas I don't feel like I can do that on Instagram, you know? Okay, this is looking cute. It's looking cute. I do feel like her eyes are too big, so I'm going to try and see what happens if we liquefy them smaller. And then push them together. <laughs> wow. 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 It's one of those things where you do it and you realize, wow, that was necessary. Um, and then I just have to fix her hair. Eh, we can fix it in the in the later, later parts. Like, what is the difference between? Wait, where to go? Whoa. Whoa. I, I can't figure it out. I feel like the smaller is the better one. 
Posting at the same time is very wise. Yeah. Boop. Boop. I feel like definitely smaller. Definitely smaller. But her forehead's too big. Maybe we pull her hair down. Let me just bring you on down there. Smaller is better. Yeah. Bless liquify. Indeed. Okay. There's like. Okay. That looks better. Um, still some things to adjust. It's so hard because I feel like eyes just seem bigger than they are. True. Ricky, can I recommend you a song that may or may not be good for Emily? Yes, you can. Excuse me. My DM recommending a song. Just assume you're correct. <laughs> Let's see it. See it. Yeah, I want to visually see the song, please. I'd like it completely written out in musical format. Um, yes. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Let's see. Open up my Discord. It's very slow when I'm streaming. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Crane Wives. Oh, the Crooked, the Cradle. Okay, okay, okay. She's a giggle at a funeral. All right. So this is apparently very Emily, says my DM. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. I'm very, I'm seeing it. Let me just add this. Oh God. Oh my God. Maybe I'll talk Emily spoilers during tomorrow's. I will posture check. Thank you. During a uh, stream tomorrow. Or should I just wait till the till the video comes out? Hmm. Thank you, Smashly. Welcome in. How are you doing? We're just listening to some music my DM recommended for my Friday character. I'm good, thank you. Excited to be back to back to proper work. <laughs> yes. We love talking about D&D here. Thank you for the lurk, feisty. Oh my God, it's literally perfect. It's kind of scary. The Crane Wives is so good if you're looking for D&D music, like for your characters specifically. <gasps> Starlight! So nice to see you here. I don't know. I hear that's actually a pretty common problem is people not. Uh... Thank you so much, Justin. I totally agree. That was good stuff. Where was I? We were on Take Me to Church. Um, That was really good. What is A1? Teach me your language. What does that mean? <laughs> A1. 
If the heavens ever did speak Oh my gosh. Yeah, Justin showed me them. They're so good. What is, what is A1? I'm sorry. I don't know a lot of terms. Okay. Let me just select, okay. I love Hosier. Hosier? I, I always say Hosier, but I don't think, maybe that's not how you pronounce it. <laughs> oh, it's steak sauce. That's because I don't use steak sauce. Yeah, <laughs> that's accurate. You abuse them? I got off, you're still sick? I'm so sorry. I hope you feel better soon, Star. Do we no longer have John Awards rewards? We do not. Um, because I need to watch his weight, basically. Also, I can't have him on camera and stuff if I'm not using camera, so I just removed them. <laughs> no, not off of your love. Don't worry. Um, I just, I'd rather be more mindful, I guess, instead of giving him treats because I'm showing him off and stuff. I don't want to give him, get him sick, you know. Okay, I'm having struggles here. Let me wait, go back to before I edited. Yeah. And I am human. Yeah, I definitely, I, I have this fear of using Jono on my stream because he's a cat. You know, and they have a certain lifespan, and I, <laughs> I, I'm a very anxious person, and I kept thinking about it, and uh, the idea of that being there made me kind of sad. So I just decided to remove them. So I will always be talking about them and showing off pictures on Discord, though. So don't worry. And we still have the Jono emotes. Um, I don't know if we have any here on Twitch, but I know we do on Discord. I, this is one of my absolute favorite versions of Baxter. Thank you so much for using your channel point star. So good. So freaking good. Okay. I need to. Why does it look so desaturated? Like, I feel like. I will hydrate, thank you. I have so many of my points were used specifically for Jono. <gasps> you have so much you can do now. I have hydrated, thank you so much, Nat. Ooh. <laughs> Why does that color not look right at all? See, that's not normal. Something's wrong here. Okay, so watch this, okay? I'm selecting this and then I'm coloring on it and it's different. Do you see? Do you see? Something is up. Something is wrong. I'm gonna go to this screen really quickly and reload my Procreate. I'm glad I'm not crazy because I was struggling way too long there. Still doing it. I, uh, I have absolutely no clue why. I don't have any. Oh, yes, I do. I figured it out. 
I figured it out. Oh, we're giving a golden goose. Ricky for streaming again and for being amazing. Oh, Nat, thank you so much. You are so sweet. Thank you, thank you. It was an effect on top, and I'm a big ding dong, and I appreciate you all so much. Thank you so much for the golden goose egg, Nat. You're so sweet. It was because I had this ad layer up top. Um, it's so subtle, but you can see the the color difference there. So now when I select it, yeah, we're Gucci. It's so subtle. Okay. I feel better. <laughs> I was like, is something wrong with my Procreate? I'm going to get a I know. All right. Back to work. <laughs> Usually it is too, but I have had glitches like that um, on Procreate. I haven't had them in a long time though. So I was like, oh no. Uh, I love how Lucas knew exactly what it was. Bless you. Yes, I definitely try to keep mine as updated as possible. With my old iPad, it had a rough time though. So with this one, it should be up to date always. Slowly going to figure out how I want to do the hair here. Okay, now that I fixed this all up, let's go backwards. Sorry, guys. Sorry, we're uh, fumbling on the hair here to go back to when I merged. Oh no, because I, I loaded it. Guess I can't do that anyways. All right, <laughs> love that for me. Let me just go like this. I prefer to start dark and then add the light. Come see me in the morning. Lucas has fallen. Sorry, I got into the habit of calling fallen Lucas recently. I really just got to call you fallen on stream so people know what I'm talking about. Um, I had that happen with me on the sunset art, wondering why my colors weren't, <laughs> weren't getting as dark as I was thinking the color should be. Had a light. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hi, I am Lucas. <laughs> Thanks. Picked it out myself. I freaking love that new cool emote. I love that they like Twitch kind of has these like small animations you can add to emotes that you already have, which is great. Um, so they had that slide in one. I thought it was perfect. Come see me in the morning. Okay, less is more, large chunks versus small. Yes, that is the goal. I need to understand. Oh, this ad layer is back. How rude. How very dare. <laughs> Amron has a lot of Jose on her playlist um, because it sounds it just yes. <laughs> I won't give my explanation on stream, but yes. Facts, absolutely. Baxter's playlist is very, very chill, very quiet. Um, I, I love it very much, um, but I use it mostly for 
um, like when I'm doing inventory and stuff, I don't think it would be a good stream playlist. It's not very hype. That's accurate. Ellie knows exactly what I'm talking about. I don't think you like the Jose song I picked for Ebros because it's more sad and not thirst trappy. Uh, that depends. What song is it? Man's been in my top five most played artists for like five years. I'm definitely listening to less K-pop this year and more like this type of music. Work song. I don't know if I actually know that song. Let's listen to it. Let me do a good search. Jose. All right, here we go. Oh. See, I don't listen to Ebros' playlist enough, and I really gotta. Actually, I haven't listened to it in so long. Don't cry? <gasps> what do you mean? Oh no. Oh, I know this song. I love this song. Oh, oh no, I'm gonna cry. For those of you who don't know, uh, Ebros is Baxter's boyfriend and I, am, he, I think he's dead at the moment. Um, but his ghost hasn't appeared to her and she knows that his ass has unfinished business, okay? Okay, so. He's not dead. I don't. I refuse to believe it. Oh, I'm just going to cry. I've added this to the Bax Bros playlist. <laughs> Apparently, yes, that's what we're doing. Making it making Ricky cry. What? 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 Oh, Avery, would you would you mind telling the story while I cry? Listen to this music. <laughs> also, that's why there's an E on her neck, if you were wondering. Yeah, but the thing is, he wasn't in his own body. Don't forget that part of the story. So it's not like we have his body to be sure. <laughs> so fun story. So fun. I'm gonna cry. Why? Why you do this to me? <laughs> I just want Bax Bros back so bad. I refuse to believe that he is dead. Not until I see his ghost. What is this duplicate? Oh, it's because the heart. I see. Let me just do 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 do. <laughs> yeah, what's her name? The bleepin' hopper. Um, okay. So I'll kind of explain it a bit more. Um, so basically, we had this fight with these really powerful um, um. Not hobgoblins, I don't think. There's something else. Um, but they're a lot more powerful. They had a mage that we weren't expecting. And um, we'll see, when Baxter goes down, because she's undead um, and she has her foot halfway in the grave, um, I have to roll to get back up, even if I'm healed. So Baxter never got back up 
when she got down, almost died. She woke up. Uh, Penner had died. <laughs> um, and Knox was back. Uh, Knox and Ebro share a body, but it is Knox's body. She's a changeling. Um, and Knox can no longer contact or feel Ebros, and that is all we know. Baxter tried to scry on Ebros immediately after Penner was brought back to life by his god. Um, and it immediately failed. <laughs> so that's the story. Oh, look at them on the screen right now! Why is it? Oh my god. <laughs> Literally, wait, isn't this? Yes, this is Bax Bros. They're my screen. I love them so much. I want to cry. Um, and then, do I still have? Yeah. Yeah. I'm really obsessed with Bax Bros. Can you tell? <laughs> I love that the PNG, PNG tuber is still smiling. <laughs> Smile through the pain. Very Baxter. Well, thank you for showing me. I've added it to the Bax Bros playlist. Um, yeah, I'll just go cry. I'll just go cry now. Don't worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> I love him so much. Literally. Boobies on my head. What didn't show up? Yes, it did. It was just there, wasn't it? I just saw it. You're crazy, crazy girl. Let me see. What is what is the command for it? It is Alt Y. Why was it, why did it last very long? Excuse me? Excuse me? One moment, please. Um, one moment, please. One moment, please. There we go. Oh, I'm not signed in. That's rude. One second. I was just signed into Streamlabs earlier today, so I don't know why I did that, but that's fine. Apparently I've forgotten my password, Uno Momento. Let me just sign in. Okay, okay. Oh, my chat reloaded. Oh, there it is. We're good, we're good. Here we go. Oh, reward is on cooldown. It has a cooldown? It's supposed to be per person. Do you know what, guys? I got this. <laughs> I got it. I'll just, uh, it should get put back next time when someone uses a channel point. So that's fine. It's perfectly fine. Yay! It was definitely there. I don't know why it didn't last. So it's like a, like a shortcut on my computer. Haley, did you listen to the Jose on Lav's playlist? Did you add it recently? Or was it there when I listened to the whole playlist? Because it was on the whole playlist, then yes. Does my memory rem remember? No. What did you say? Oh my gosh. Starlight! Thank you so much for the tip! You sweet bean! Thank you, thank you! Don't worry. We've got lots of commissions lined up, you and I, Starlight. You sweet bean. That's what Baxter said. To your why didn't it last very long? Well, when you roll two nat ones, it's a rough, it's a rough time. You added more this morning? Oh my gosh. Well, tell me you also added the um, beautiful things. I will have to listen to it. Just another quick shout out to Starlight again. Thank you so, so, so much for the donation. Um, if anybody hasn't seen yet, I do have emergency commissions open at the moment. They are on sale for 10% off for regular clients and 30% off for Patreon members. It is only $3 to join the Patreon, so it's quite the discount. Um, and yeah, it's to help me pay bills this month because I, I don't have anything. <laughs> it's going very well over here. Yes, the tarot command does still work indeed. I would never take that fun away from us. Are you kidding me? 
<gasps> Ooh, uh, is it a good secret or a sad secret? What kind of secret? What's the vibe of this secret, Star? <laughs> Maybe I'll just sing about it. Cause you can't jump the track It's like cars on a cable And life's like an hourglass Glued to the table Yes! Also, friendly reminder, everybody, if you sub this month, you do get to request a goose. And on the 26th, we are going to do a doodle the goose, doodle a goose stream where I doodle a bunch of gooses. Um, there's a lot of different random suggestions so far. I know we have astronaut, elf, cat. Um, I can't remember what else. <laughs> On the Backspurs playlist, going to need to add Chris in my pants. <laughs> oh my god. I bought Buddy a commission of our new d, &D character in the Twilight movie theme because... <gasps> That's amazing. Oh, I'm so excited. That's so awesome. That's going to be so much fun. I can't wait to hear more about that. Oh, oh my gosh. In a Twilight theme, Bunny's going to die. Bunny's going to love that. I was going to add another Lonely Island song. Oh my god. Lorian's playlist is going to be a bop. Anger inside of me, threatening the life it belongs to. Oh, I'm sorry. If it makes you feel any better, gifted subs do not equal a uh, doodle goose. It is the, the paying member who gets the doodle goose. So it would be the person who gifted you. So don't stress, Nat. Whatever you want to. Cause it can't jump the track. Were you gonna romance their character in the game with my pally? No, no, no. You well, you can gift. You absolutely can. You just don't get an extra goose or anything like that. Um, and then if someone who has a gifted sub wants a goose, then they can pay it forward and give a gift to somebody else, and then they can get a sub. Does that make sense? Just breathe. Oh, breathe. The song is so pretty. It's it's from Grey's Anatomy. It was in, well, it's not from Grey's Anatomy, but that's where I heard it. And I was like, yeah, playlist. <laughs> Bunny's gonna shit. Factual. But now we have a new game that was offered. Ooh. <gasps> Boo. Hello, Ellie. How you doing? How you doing? What's good? Oh, I'm sure both both Avery and I would be very honored, Nat. I'm glad you enjoy them so. Also, blue and red is so iconic. Such good colors together. I had to take a call. Okay, FBI man. <laughs> Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. We're vibing, chilling. As we do. My next commission in line is one of the characters. I'll get those refs soon, but I know he's a ways away anyways. Wow, that was a mouthful. You could type as many mouthfuls as you want. And yes, um, commissions are a bit behind, but um, I'm going to be going hard. I already finished one today, and then I'm going to be working on one tonight um, while we hang out. I don't know if you're going to be there, Star, but uh, I know we're doing a watch of the Critical Role thing tonight. The Baldur's Gate 3, they're building their characters because it's like a sick day. And uh, so I'm going to be working on the commission that's right before yours. Try and get that one done so I can work on yours.
She has so much hair. <laughs> so much. Do your characters have a face claim? They do. Um, Baxter's, I don't know for sure. Um, I'm pretty sure I know who Ebrose's is, but I'll let Avery answer that. Baxter's is Emily Browning. She's a very difficult face. <laughs> you guys are way too sweet. I'm glad y'all are enjoying the art. I'm excited for this art print. It'll be limited run for sure since it's an OC artwork, so... If you are interested, be sure to join the Patreon in February. Thank you, Els. Yes, Ebros is Henry Calvo. It's fun designing characters with long hair until you have to render it. Lilith, facts, absolute freaking facts. I think about it a lot, honestly. That's one of the reasons I'm debating on having Emily at least have her hair like braided back. I'm thinking a bubble braid. Think. Think Shadowheart, but maybe like it starts off lower, maybe like more like Jasmine um, and definitely bigger, more like Jasmine than Shadowheart. Yes, I have an OC card that I'm slowly working on. Um, it requires a lot of work. Wait a minute. It would look cute, like a noble updo. Yeah. Oh, man, Avery, in one of my discords, everyone was talking about Henry Cavill, about how they would climb him like a tree. And you came to mind, Baxter would also climb him like a tree. She is 5'1". She would need to. <laughs> That's absolute facts. I split the bottom part of her hair in the top. It's just a lot easier. <laughs> big men with big hearts and nerdy selves. So true. We have an hour and 10 minutes left of stream. I will be back again tomorrow. There's also a big chance, um, just so everybody knows, I'm going to be streaming as regular as possible, but additionally, I'm going to be streaming more than my schedule, probably. I'd like to try streaming more in general, especially because I have the stream set up better now for when I need to maybe message a commissioner, like I have a screen that can hide my iPad without it being too difficult or ugly. Um, and I do know people do prefer to see the beginning of stuff more often. So we're going to be keeping it as chill as possible. Uh, and, uh, that's why my PNG tuber is a big thing. I'm definitely going to be using her a lot more than Cam for a while until I'm more comfortable. Um, but yeah, I hope that's okay. Um, but hopefully we'll be getting lots of work done this <laughs> I couldn't climb him like a tree because we were essentially the same height. He definitely looks taller than six foot, but it makes sense. All right, so let's, uh, I need to fix this bit for when we liquefied.
how to do face claims well. Honestly, same, Nat. It's a long process. Take your time. Have fun with it. Um, Baxter's face claim is so difficult for me. Like, that's 100% how I picture her. But she has such a round face, like, like very prominent cheekbones. I hope you guys aren't bored of the hair. If you are, just let me know. Now I'll move on to another piece for now. Searching through my Spotify for everyone. So he says he's six foot one, LOL, but not literally that different. No. How tall are you again, Avery? I can't remember. <laughs> Hi, Kobe. Welcome in. Thank you for reminding us that Baxter is indeed baby. I will edit this when I've finished doing the base because that's easier. Hi. Five foot eleven and a half. Oh yeah, you're pretty close. I am five five in real life. But I love making short short ladies. Keep me. I love this song so much. This one is a, a labyrinth song in my brain. I don't think it's in the labyrinth playlist though. Just crouch and then you can pounce. <laughs> I'm not that short. Wait, how, how tall are you else? I thought you were shorter than me. You're a short bean. Aren't you shorter than me? Am I wrong? Am I that short? 5'5 five five is pretty average, I think. I mean, I'd rather be short. Don't get me wrong. But don't get my hopes up like that. Yeah, Lucas is shorter than me. <laughs> You're 5'8? Yeah, see? See, see? I'm not that short. I wish I was. I think I like growth spurt it really early. Wow, that was a weird way to say that. Um, so I was like a tall girl for a while and I hated being taller than all the guys in my class. And maybe that that trauma has made me like just be obsessed with being short. <laughs> 411, yeah, for sure. We have literally held hands. How do you not remember? Girl, I'm literally the most forgetful person you've ever met. Like, I remember holding hands with you, but I don't remember going shoulder to shoulder with you and how it compares, you know? I feel like I feel like I remember having a conversation where I was the tallest with you and Sarah. So maybe that's why I'm thinking of that. And I'm just silly and forgetful, as per usual. It was too long ago. My memory is crap. Yes. Sarah's definitely shorter than me. I think only, I think she's 5'4", though. Like, it's not too big of a difference. I know, right? I totally agree. She does give up. Well, I feel like I could see how she gives off tall vibes now that I'm thinking about it. To me, she gives off short, but that, be, that could be because I know, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and change I thought she was four too <laughs> we have some butts to kick then 
I think it's so lame that people bully other people about, like, their height as if it's their fault or as if it matters. Like, it's actually kind of wild if you think about it. Called you a giant? Have they seen giants? Clearly they don't play D&D. <laughs> I am right. She's definitely 4'2". <laughs> Should we be bullying her if she's not here? Is that appropriate? What is this song? Oh, yes. I understand now. <laughs> Here you go, Justin and Avery and uh, and Ellie. It's so good. <laughs> just so you know, Fallen, that's not her real height. We just like to bully her. <laughs> this is Amarin's playlist. I think that looks good. I think it looks okay. Need a bit more going on over here. Maybe we'll do that with the airbrush after. I feel like that's going to be the better choice. If you have it in for the last verse, Ascensionism for, for Amarin. I don't think she's she's ascending. She's just... I believe supposed to be the champion of the Raven Queen. That's more just like dead and working. <laughs> dead and never retiring. <laughs> Also, I'm very surprised I haven't fallen asleep. Toby did move to snuggle rather than smothering me. I mean, snuggles are still usually, you know, sleep inducing. All right, that looks good. That looks good. I like it. I like it. Oh, we have another side of this hair. Gosh darn. We're just going to go like that. Or maybe it's all fallen. Maybe we don't even need it. No, it would be there. It would be there. Thank you so much, Kobe. It's killing me. <laughs> it's too much hair. I can't do it. I'm over it. Such a risk when you make a long-haired character. I'll go like that and then I will shade it again just so it looks darker. Yeah. Like so. Maybe he's run out of ma ma mana for his ma mana, mana for his magic. Maybe. I listened a lot to the song when Ebros and Baxter drama started. She didn't mean to start drama. She just didn't want to hurt him. She's not, she's not one for drama. She really isn't. I apologize in advance for Vaughn. Ah, uh, yeah, that's okay. 
alas, I do not charge or, well, I don't always charge for hair depending on if it's an emergency commission or not. And that's okay. That's on me. My love, did you say you were a sign from God? Oh, so good. So good, Justin. No, I mean, when Knox first appeared after the date, here's the thing. Here's some tea for you. Baxter at first was angry. And as soon as she understood, she realized what was going on. And instead, she used her anger as a barrier to start them not being together to protect Knox. As soon as it was explained to her, she figured it out. She still doesn't like that you were taking drugs in a in, in someone else's body. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, she was she was not as um, upset about Knox as she pretended to be. I will always remember being like, yeah, yeah, I'm going to get a comment from Ricky and my boy Ori because I love how she does hair and then decided I didn't want to torture her with him. And also the campaign he was in imploded. Oh, man, bless you. <laughs> I got to make a hair tutorial, but I feel like I don't know if I want to do a tutorial or a study because I'm still like kind of deciding on how I want to do it. Although I think I'm happy with this. I just need to find the step by step, I think. Which tutorial should I do for Patreon this month, though? That's what I'm trying to decide. If you like this part of the song, listen. Oh, listen to Ascensionism. As in there's a song called Ascensionism. I'm assuming by Sleep Token. Okay, remind me to listen to it. Like when I'm not on stream. <laughs> I'm going to take a break from uh, playing songs right now. Because I do really desperately need to get this done. Because I also need to make the flowers into a sticker. Okay, I feel like... Yeah. All right. All right, then. Oh, this song. Oh, so good. There's light going through this. So we want to do this. I'm so a sleep token is coming to Australia with Bring Me to the Horizon, but tickets cost a lot, but also it's sleep token. Do it. Do it, Lucas. I don't think you'll regret it. Oh. So good. For three? It was that for three tickets, though, Justin. If you don't go, I'll never forgive you. Yeah, it cost me that much for Blackpink as well. Honestly, I'm not shocked. I feel like that's going to be the cost of all concerts now if they're popular at all. I don't have anyone to go with. I, uh, yeah, I don't drive and it's in Sydney and I don't trust going to Sydney on my own. There's got to be someone who'd want to go with you. If I win the lottery, I will, I will, I will make you go. I will go and be like, okay, we're going. <laughs> I don't even t partake in the, in the, in the, in the, in the, in the lottery, but like, it's a nice thought. <laughs> you can protect me from the spiders. Yeah. The dream.
I keep seeing the line of the lollipop earring and being like, oh no, I accidentally drew a line. What song is this? It is called, it is called Way Down We Go, stripped by Kaleo. K-A, like kale, like the veggie. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh, my pleasure, Kobe. Um, there's three more songs left in this playlist. My head still hurts. You need to, you need to drink lots of water, eat some food. Not to anything carby, because those can give you headaches too. I've been living off the road, made a bug off my soul. How I am, Ren. Although it was not singing. <laughs> <clears throat> I like the number two. You'll bring your spider smacking slipper. You have an assigned slipper for spider smacking. I adore that for you. Oh, this song is so pretty. <laughs> okay just a thought really quickly here do i want to use this one do I want to use mm, probably, probably this one? Let's see. What if I go like that? In theory, what if I did, what if I did this? What if, fuck you. What if I did this and then selected it and then cut? Yeah. I think I prefer it to be semi see-through than hold. Is this how you're doing what? Doing what? Yes. Yes, that's correct. Baxter's five foot one. She's a short bean. Uh, Avery, go with cut. <laughs> Avery, go with cut. Avery, Avery, is that number two? Go with number two. Like ripped, right? Super cut. <laughs> 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 okay without context this sounds like something else it's probably it's pro kobe it's probably the something else you're thinking of it's probably that <laughs> you know i don't think you even need the context i think you got it <laughs> yeah cut her bulk i'm gonna say cut I'm going to say cut. I feel bad for whoever is not following this. Look at her little tummy. She's so cute. Wait, 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 I did? I did vote that? Good. That's good. <laughs> Something's gotta give. Mm -hmm. This song reminds me so much of Amarin. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> it's just its world. I'm rendering long, voluminous, wavy hair too now. Send prayers. I'm sending you all the prayers. All the prayers. What is it from that show that I haven't watched yet? Sorrows, prayers, <laughs> or something. We have to, to 45 minutes about left of stream, everybody. Then we will be raiding someone. If you can stick around for the raid once we get there, that would be lovely. It's, um, it's, really, it's really a nice moment. It's a good, lovely community little moment. <laughs> Queen Charlotte, yes. Sorrows, prayers. I don't remember exactly what she said, but it's something like that. Sorrows, sorrows, prayers. Yeah. I will watch Queen Charlotte eventually. I have a hard time watching things um, that I haven't seen before because I'm usually drawing at the same time. Oh, here we go. Here it is. For the third time this stream, please, everybody, go show love to Benson Boone on TikTok because I'm playing the shit out of his song today. Excuse me, I forgot to draw her hair biddies. And I've been forgetting those a lot lately, I feel like. I need to watch it also. I need to emotionally prepare first, though. Is it really emotionally draining? That's good to know. Here we go. Prepare your booties. Prepare yourself. Ugh. I want to I just want to get a banana bag with this song. <laughs> Only from what I know of the canon in Bridgerton outside of Queen Charlotte. Okay, 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 okay. I loved Bridgerton. I'll rewatch it one day. <laughs> I'm sure. banana bag yeah like an IV <laughs> like an IV of that song that's what I want okay so it's it's just playing songs that I listen to a lot I think now or recommended I hope that's cool good vibes sorrows sorrows prayers I really just want to like read something I love reading stuff Pretending to be somebody else. It's so fun. Jonathan Bailey is 10 10 super hot. That's the main guy in this second season, correct? <laughs> yeah, banana bag. Look at her, she's so cute. She's just the cutest bean. I 
I have a lot of really short songs on my playlist, I'm starting to realize. Should we finish her skin or take pause? Let's take pause. Let's take pause. We can do the hand really quickly. Unfortunately, I think we have to do the hand first. Don't look at it too too closely. Please, thank you. <laughs> All right. If someone wants a more hype playlist, let me know and I will seek one out. Or we'll go to our basic, uh, our stream playlist that I do. Wow, I haven't taken a single pee break, guys. It's been two hours and 20 minutes. Like, pat on the back? Wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah, well, no, I kind of have to pee. That's what made me think of it. So to be fair, I, I'm not causing it. It just sort of... <laughs> I'm more partial to Luke Newton, a.k.a. Colin Bridgerton. Colin, really? I will hydrate. Thank you, Nat. I... Hold on. Okay, so Colin gives me a bit of an ick. Um, I don't know why. I don't trust him. I don't trust him to take care of our lovely, beautiful uh, Penny. Penny, right? Penelope, the redhead. Um, I will say if I had to pick one of the brothers, um, not in regards to his life choices or anything like that, um, I love the artist. I think he's super hot. I did that. <laughs> Thank you so much for Caxter. I adore Caxter. She's also one of my favorites. I feel like I usually do cutesy stuff for Baxter, but like she is 27, 27 years old. So Benedict? Yeah, I think so. I'm hoping out there will be leaves to cover this weird ass arm. <laughs> the goal. Come to me, wild and wired. I would. <laughs> All right. All right, I need some more hype music because I am getting sleepy and I don't have time for that. Um, Winnie's Blows is really hype. We could listen to that. Or we could just listen to Pop Champ. <laughs> or we could listen to K-pop. Hmm. Hmm. What's the vibe, you guys? There was going to be more to that sentence, but life censored me by hitting send too soon. And that's probably for the best. I would. <laughs> Amazing. Here we go. Oh, no, I really do have to pee now. It's all my fault. It's all my fault that I mentioned it. All right, stinkies. I'll be right back. I'm going to do a little walk around. We have about 40 minutes left to stream, a little bit less than that. Um, everybody be good. Make good choices. Grab some water if you need. Do a stretch. Um, if you're drawing, please make sure to stretch your arms as someone who has tendinitis. Uh, I promise. Do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs>
Hello. I hath returned. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? How's it hanging? All right. We got this. We have under half an hour left of stream. I'll be back again tomorrow. I don't know if I've ever listened to punk music, but Angel with a Shotgun is really good. It is really good. It's on the Laverne playlist, actually. Angel with a Shotgun. Dun, 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 dun. Hell yeah. Good choice, that. All right, we're going to pause there. Let's do the shirt. I love pop punk from the early 2000s. Hell yeah. I absolutely agree. Lying harder than yourself alone. Oh, this doesn't look like her face claim at all, though. But it's okay. She's still cute. I will have to continue practicing. My fix for the backs being too tall and thick, I'm going to make it so Ebros is lifting her up instead of her standing. Perfect. That's a perfect idea. For once, I'm not going to be blending in the line art like I usually do. Instead, I'm using it as a base. So I added the details, like the, the seams and stuff, in the line art this time. Did I save? Um, no, that's something else. It looks so soft. Weird question. Is Kitchen Cat in the chat at the moment? I don't think they are, but if you are, say hello. <laughs> I'm getting messages from them on Discord. And I cannot type at the moment. Mm Cute. All right. <laughs> What 
am I using here? Yeah, I was gonna say that is not my brush. That's not what I want. I don't know. I've been on TikTok recently and saw people trying to cancel an artist or like because he does a very similar art style for the faces of most of his drawings. I don't know why it bothers me because people don't know how hard it is to find your personal art style. I, I actually made a video about... Um, uh, what's it called? Same face uh, syndrome is what a lot of people call it. I just say style. Um, I really do think there's pros to having same face style. So I don't think canceling someone for that is the same. I do think that if you're because I do remember there was an artist that I do really like um, who had who has that um, and released a piece of Ellie from The Last of Us. And she has a very distinct face. Um, but not just that, she got a lot of hate for not being what people expected, which is horrible because that actress is stunning. Um, but he drew the face very much basic, I guess you could say, which is totally fine. I, uh, well, in this case, I didn't, I didn't, I wasn't a fan of that. I don't think that that's so great. I do think there's a time and a place if you're someone who has similar art style for all your faces. I do think there's a time and a place to branch out. Um, I do think it's really great to have more representation in your art, but I also think that same face style is incredibly marketable. So it kind of, it all depends on what you're working on at that time. So <sighs> people are gonna people, I think is what it comes down to. People are gonna people. I think I scared everyone away with my break, hey Nat? <laughs> What canvas size do you work on in Procreate? So if you get this question, I do not mind this question at all. I do uh, 30, nope, 3605 pixels by 4500 pixels, not pickles, pixels, um, and 350 DPI. And then depending on what you're using, you only get so many layers. So do keep that in mind. I am ready for a reading. What am I reading today? <laughs> Wrong command? I know, I should put it in there, hey? I feel like that'd be a good thing to put in there under tools. So you're not wrong, Feisty. Also, welcome back. How will Tyranny of Dragons go? Inspiration and keen intellect, a future event, the outcome of which will hinge on a clever mind. Ooh, exciting. I'm excited to hear more about this campaign. I have a little date with uh, Eva this evening to hear all about it so <laughs> I get to know all the behind the scenes stuff this time um I don't know what you're playing what are, what, are, what are you playing star without without spoilers if anybody's in the chat uh totally fair I'm not a player what uh 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 <laughs> I agree, it just sucks because people pick apart things and when the specific artist drew that picture, they may still be learning how to implement their art style on different features True, too. That's very true. I think if we're talking about the same artist, I think what it comes down to is that they, they have a platform and in this case, it didn't feel like an effort was made. Um, and sometimes it's the consideration of, do I post this? Do I post this or do I wait and try again? Um, because that is something that's kind of important, you know? Yeah. Our lovely friend is DMing it, um, and I do not have the time for more games, so I get to hear all the all the details instead. Half elf rogue, ooh, that's exciting. Does your character have a name that you're comfortable sharing? No one is here. He's actually damn fear. Ooh, ooh, tell me more. Sneaky secrets. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Eva came up with he got experimented on by a dragon. Ooh. Ooh, that's so exciting. Okay, quick side note. Quick, complete side side se segue here. Um, If anybody reads Webtoons, does anybody read um Eternal Nocturnal? Oh, my God. Star, you have to read that. I don't know if it'll be related at all, but you're reminding me of it. It's eternal, nocturnal, I believe. It, they it's spelled like eternal, nocturnal because it's about dream eaters. Let me type it out. Eternal, nocturnal, eternal. I believe. I believe so. I can actually check. Where's my phone? <laughs> Uno momento. Webtoon. It's one of my favorite webtoons right now. It's killing me that it only comes out like every Thursday. Where are you? Yeah. Eternal Nocturnal. There are 83 episodes out right now. Um, but you should totally give that a read. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sub-Zero? I started Sub-Zero. I'm more of like, I prefer like romance oriented. I think Sub-Zero does have romance, but I think it was more heavy on the action. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with that, but I love my webtoons for my romance. My favorite webtoon of all time is um, Freaking Romance. Ugh. Ugh. I own the first one and I want to pre-order the second one. Um, it's not out to my birthday. He was inspired by Nightmare Inspector, an old manga about Baku, Dream Eaters. <gasps> That's cool. I've never heard of it. That's really cool. Okay, if I do screen with this pink color. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. This is cool. It's looking very materially. <laughs> Always the goal. Thanks, Feisty. <laughs> Thanks, Star. Oh, look at her flower crown. It's like a sticker. I love the whole, like, more flats like sticker vibe with the new stream setup. It's one of my favorite things about it. Okay, so I do want this top to be like a thick material. So I'm actually gonna add a seam. I don't want it to be perfect though. So I'm going to use a soft airbrush along the edge as if it's like a thick material. So it's kind of rounded instead of a sharp cut. <laughs> I love all the different Baxters. I worked so hard on them, you guys. That was one of the biggest things that took up my time uh, in the first couple weeks of January. I went hard. And it was hard to do some of them. Um, like the sprout one, I had to adjust the color a bit. It's still not perfect. You can see how unperfect it is in like the bigger screen versions. Um, but because it's a green screen is how it, how it works, right? So the green items had to be adjusted or made a different color. All right, so we got that. I'm gonna go on a different layer so I don't accidentally erase this. There, now it looks like there's like almost boning in the top of this shirt. Help hold it up since she, she doesn't have the assets for that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
I need to fix her eyes. Her eyes doesn't look don't look like they're smiling, if that makes sense. How will my D&D go, game go on Sunday? Lies and deceit. Deceit. Oh my gosh, I cannot talk. Lies and deceit. Grand conspiracies. Secret societies. The presence of a dupe or saboteur. Yes. A saboteur. No. Is that how you say it? I've, I have no idea. I have no idea what that word is. Sounds amazing. Let me know if that's accurate. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Like a changeling shows up or something. You think that's how you say it? Oh, that's good. That'd be embarrassing. That'd be awkward. <laughs> Mariana is meeting her little brother again for the first time in eight years. <gasps> what if he's not her real little brother? Is that what you're thinking? All right, we have under 10 minutes left of stream because I do have to do the raid during that time as well. Just make sure I'm not missing anything here. <laughs> She'll cry, oh no. Yeah, like a light pink jean. Ricky, will you join for the CR Hottie time? Yes, that is the plan. <laughs> we have like a friends Discord server uh, for with like Star and um, a handful and they're doing like a CR watch tonight. It's called the Hottie server. <laughs> yeah, it's cute. I mean, also factual. That's true. I'm gonna go like this. <laughs> Super true. <laughs> You're not wrong. Mm -hmm. All right, do you know what? We're actually going to end stream here and we'll we'll do the jeans start of stream tomorrow. Because I do have to do a raid. Because I do have plans with someone right after stream before the hangout. So, let me see. Is anybody still here? Say goose if you're here for the raid. Oh, oh my god, I can play. I can. My music is connected on Spotify on my phone. Okay, hopefully that doesn't affect it. All right, we've got a goose, a duck, and a goose. That's three people. If anybody else is, do let me know. But also, you do not have to. Okay, so Illyria is live. Love them. Cnot is live. Cnot does these really, really cool sculpting videos, usually of fantasy characters, um, of like actual like, like, like clay and stuff. That's phenomenal. Bilvi is live, working on emotes. And there's a good handful. Okay. So here's our, here's our options, okay? We've got Bill V, who's working on emotes. We've got um, Silas A. Oh, let's do them. Oh my gosh, I love their stuff so much. They're just chatting at the moment, but they will be doing art. They're one of my favorite fantasy artists. If you don't know who they are, once we raid them, please do check out their socials. They're so good, you guys. <laughs> Let me get a raid message ready. Thank you so much, Star, for reminding me. Raid, raid, boo, boo. Hey, 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 Liz. It says no voice art only day, but they're definitely using, they're 
they're on just chatting. So, okay. Hey, 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 Liz Raid. We'll see what's up. We'll show them some love either way because I really do love their artwork and I want you to check them out. So that is the raid message. If you could really, oh my God, that's, so, that's crazy star. Um, then we're definitely going to go show her some love. I will be live again tomorrow. Um, earlier in the day, do follow the discord for those updates and times and stuff like that. That's usually where I post first. If I'm changing the time or streaming early, that kind of stuff. Um, so do come hang out tomorrow. Thank you so much, everybody for coming to hang out today. It's been absolutely lovely. Sigh, let's say. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I have anything else to say at the moment other than I think you guys are really amazing. I had a really wonderful stream. Thank you for hanging out. I hope you guys come and watch uh, the CR stuff later. Um, I'm sure it's going to be a gong show. It's going to be really fun. Um, I will see you all tomorrow. Everybody, please be good and wash your feet. Bye.